Okay. Hello, everybody. So, I have taken a bit of a leap of faith in my life and uh, will be now streaming and doing YouTube videos. And I thought, you know, it would be a fun first game to play Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. I loved this game as a teenager. Um, I had the little Game Boy SP that I played it on all the time. <clears throat> I have fond memories of it, so let us get into it. Um, I will not be using safe state. Um, Story-wise and stuff, I will be using the uh, speed button. Just to save myself a little bit of time. But on that, we're going to go for a full playthrough. Yeah. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Feminism! Oh, I love Ritz's character. And we're gonna go with... Kuma. Yep. Because I'm a big old bird. I've always had a, a fondness for uh, these tactical strategy games. Uh, Fire Emblem is one of my favorite game series. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. I'm sure at some point I will probably play the Final Fantasy 1. Uh, another one of my favorite games of all time. I believe I've beaten it on every iteration that's ever came out. You know, Game Boy Advance version, the PSP release for the anniversary, and that sort of stuff. I just love it. Tutorial. Slow ass tutorial. Alright. Oof, like I don't know how to play this game. Action. Right up in his face! Blam! And stare at him the whole time. Lyle the dick. Hit this asshole in the back of the head! Um, if you're watching this on YouTube, I haven't decided yet how worried about it I'm going to honestly be. Um, I have chosen the tag Kuma the Swear Bear. Um, I might edit out any cursing I do. I might not, depending on how I feel about how badly they're going to enforce the new the new ad uh, advertiser-friendly monetization of YouTube videos. Um, <coughs> oh, excuse me. Gaming s videos haven't seemed to be massively affected yet, as far as swearing, but you never know. We'll see what happens. At least it looks like a butt. <laughs> butt. They do not like loot. They can't hit him. They don't like him. Uh, if I remember correctly, you can't win this. They just have so much health, and you're doing one at a time. And I'm pretty sure it's over once mute. Once mute gets knocked down. Oh no, that was it. Yeah, somebody put a rock in the snowball. Because asshats. A uh, bunch of stuff. His little brother's sick. Uh, what kind of book are you going to go buy? It's about monsters and magic, stuff like that. So he's essentially going to go fi buy like a game guide to D&D uh, &D or Final Fantasy, something like that. Uh, we're, the, we're the nerds. I mean, simple as that. C 
the yellow house. Because there's only one, apparently. There's nobody else in this entire area has a yellow house. The school's yellow. Holy crap, everything's red. Uh, they might be able to find his house through that very vague description. Uh, that's Neat's dad, isn't it? He's like a bum. Or he's in trouble with some... He's a bum, or something. He's a, he's a screw up, essentially. And uh, that's the whole thing. His dad's kind of a bum. I am not as musically inclined as some people, so I might hum to myself, and it might not be the song that's playing. But it's Final Fantasy, so it has fantastic music. Even on, like, a Game Boy game? Even for a Game Boy game? It's got spot-on music. Um... I've decided to make this a, uh, a YouTube only video because I love this game and one thing that I really don't need to happen is for the little mistakes and things that I make throughout the game if by some miracle in like a week this takes off and my stream gets amazingly popular I don't want to sit there and watch chat yell at me for every stupid thing I've ever done on this game so I'm just gonna play it for funsies put up a YouTube video I'm still gonna stream um, yeah. Make quick. Gotta check that drink real quick. Okay, <sighs> you like books, don't you? <laughs> Your legs don't work. It's kind of mean. <laughs> It's a little mean to his brother. Not, not, you know, in an intentional sense, but... <laughs> All you do is sit around and read books. I can't walk. <laughs> you know what I mean? I really enjoy the aesthetic of this game. I really do. The sort of, like, mix of stuff. Like, you know, there's the TV and the lamp right next to the old coal stove. <laughs> oh, I've had a mouse in the way the whole time. Wow, that's an interesting book. Uh, no book I've ever read has done this. I, just, I really enjoy the illustrations and the, 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 just the animations on this. There they are. Oh, Bangus. Favorite race in the game. Um, at some point, I might also do this for Final Fantasy Tactics, War of the Lions. I really enjoyed that game. Uh, Grimoire of the Rift. It's not a bad game. Don't get me wrong. Not a bad game. Just not one of my favorites. <laughs> it was... Improved, but other than that, there wasn't much really. It's not funny. <laughs> you suck at sports ball. Your legs don't work. If this was a real sibling rivalry, that's what it would be. You suck at sports. Mom doesn't love you because your legs don't work. <laughs> I also love how there's there's just one distinction to make you tell whose bed is whose. The skateboard in the corner. <laughs> Jingle ass. 
best pot out of the corner. I love, I love that little tea kettle. The rabbit ears on the TV. It's just, this game was... And, it's, and, and you know, of course, this is a, a full screen capture so you can see the pixels. But on that, that tiny Game Boy screen, oh, it was so fucking beautiful. Uh, but, I mean, all games are like that. I mean, if I... If I were to shrink this down to the little tiny one eighth of my screen proportion, that uh, the uh, program originally puts it in to you know, simulate the Game Boy Advance screen, this would be amazing looking. <laughs> uh, this is we all if you played this game, you've seen that. This is the oh weird stuff's happening at night. People are getting turned into stuff. Bro's gone. Oh god! Like that, right there. A little idle chatter in the background. That's a really nice touch. You know, it's it's that it's just far enough away that it's indiscreet. You can't tell what they're actually saying. Ah! Those are people! thing Square Enix has ever done. The Moogle. Soldier. The judge! Judge Fish. Beat all your enemies. I don't even have a weapon. I don't know. I don't think I have any skills. Well, the... the Mont Blanc probably does because he's a black mage, I think, at this point. This kid's also a little... special. All items. Okay, so what you do is you go. I love how they they kind of ran with the whole judge thing. Um, oh, is this one looks like. Ooh, recommend it. dark. This lets you see the turn order. It's really good. Now all we do is remove behind him. What battle tech do I have? First aid, fight. I do damage. Now he's probably going to come right here. Oh no, he's going to hit Mont Blanc in the back. Oh no. Mont Blanc might be in trouble. Except for it's Mont Blanc's turn next, so I can move him out of the way and hit that area with some sort of. Uh... Oh, yeah, I don't have control of him. But he's probably going to hit that area with ice damage. Good, good. Blizzard! I love the magic animations in this game, too. I mean, the little sound effects are nice and everything. Judge points. We'll tell you, fight judge points. That way you can use combos when other player members it makes it easier to snap. Yes, gotcha. There's also, uh, isn't there another way? There's another way you get judge points, like, just, like, following the rules. 
Like he also recommended dark. If you use a dark spell, or you cause dark, it also gives you judge points. I, I did always like the fact that the judge takes up a space. So if you were so inclined, you could actually use the judge to position yourself. Run off and heal. Not a bad eye. Ooh. Oh no, recover is just status ailments. That's what it was. How did Mont Blanc heal himself all the way? I don't remember judge points healing you. It might just be because he's an NPC. Mont Blanc got all the judge points. That suckies. But I don't think there was any other way to do that other than just not attacking like Mont Blanc hit him a couple times and then hit him <clears throat> to finish him off. Where's that potion? Oh, he's gonna take it. He's gonna get a red card. Which actually is, is very, um, is very um, deceptive, because you get a yellow card first. He didn't use an item throughout the whole... Also, the engagement's actually over. So... You know what I mean? The engagement's over, so the laws... are actually no longer in place. <laughs> The laws are all, always seemed a little arbitrary to me. What's the point of the laws? Never ever call Panga a lizard. You, that's racist. Uh, <laughs> you just said a bunch of words. I don't know. Also. Your rabbit dragon. Evelise. called Final Fantasy, yeah. <sighs> this weird, um, making fun of itself. I, I like that, too. The whole self-awareness. Look, he's gonna help me. I didn't hate Moogles. I prefer the um I preferred Banga. My favorite was always um the the elephant people's castles over Moogles. You know what I mean? Those are always actually my favorite.
Why do you not have a name? Nutsy. I'm not naming my clan Nutsy. The I wonder if it'll let me put in the swear bears. Let's just try swear bears. Perfect. Clan swear bear. I did, I did like this whole, um, like build your own kind of map. Soldier, a thief, a white mage, a black mage, and a archer. What do we have? We have another soldier. Rodrigo! <laughs> and we have a white monk, a warrior. After we have a white monk, because I love monks. <sighs> we have monk the cello. La cello. Uh, we have a white mage, we have a white mage. Archer, Black Mage, Soldier and Monk, but we don't have a Thief. Items teach you uh, abilities. It's actually really cool how they did this. So you get uh, you show and you brush with fire. Did they have an optimize button? No. 
So you would go to different areas. You go to the pub. Tell you about rumors. Um, too many buttons today. Tell you about rumors. And then he gives you missions. Boards, that kind of stuff. Then you have certain items that you can take with you on a mission. Uh, certain items you have to, or certain ones you have to have mission items. There's also certain ways, um, there's also certain items you can put in place and then it will affect the rewards you get for the mission. There's even some secret characters which you have to have specific items on missions for. We're gonna go on this first mission. Yay! You love the planes. We're gonna pick some herbs. Well, that means we're gonna fight goblins, because they're in our way. Goblins and a fairy. I think you can take everybody on this first mission? Yeah. Let's put him more towards the back with the archer. Do 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 what are the laws? Let's see what the laws are. She's gonna do something bad, isn't she? Nope. Really? I can't use my knife? Does he have any monk techniques? It's one of the most important monk abilities. It's a really strong ranged attack. Shell or protect or anything? Nope, just pure. And this was a cool thing is you can actually hit your own characters. So say you had something that you know, raises your attack power every time you're hit. If you want to artificially inflate your own attack damage, you can. First aid, yeah. And then, of course, this whole the whole facing mechanic, which is classic of uh, Final Fantasy Tactics in of itself, is here. So it's fun. The only thing that sucks is I can't. I just bought a knife, but I can't. My main character only run stealing. <laughs> because he can't use his weapon. The one thing I did enjoy in this over War of the Lions was this. I tell him to do thunder, he does thunder. I don't have to worry about what position they are and how long it's gonna take him to to cast the magic. And of course the trade-off is, 
mages are extremely squishy. Ooh, that's a perfect rolling opportunity right there. Either one of them are looking at me. Let's do this. Essentially, each race has a uh, totem up. And then you get, I believe, 10 JP. You can summon your totem up. You can summon your race's avatar. And it just, like, does massive damage across the entire uh, battlefield. So they're really cool. Uh, I didn't worry too much about them when I was playing. I mean, I worried about them, but I wasn't, like... I have to get a totem I have to get a totem I have to get a totem up. There we go. Let's increase my chances of hitting. Aim. Boost. Oh, this is just a, a self buff. It, I, it was in high school. I was playing it for fun. I didn't really super pay attention to anything. You know, I wasn't playing as efficiently as efficiently as I could. Yeah, I was being smart about stuff, but I wasn't, you know, paying attention to buffs and self-buffs and things like that all too much because, you know, it was just fun. It was a game to play, like, on the school bus and stuff. Oh, yeah, he moves the dead bodies around so they're not just in the way. I think they also have one of them, or is he just going to punch me? Oh, he punches like a monster. Ah, miss! <sighs> nice. My load of gill stolen. since I didn't hit him at all. 26 damage. Ooh, nice fire. Uh, the, uh, the red one, of course, is... is And of course, you know, it's level one, so I don't have any of my counters or anything like that. Blue one, I think. Ooh, critical! Yes! He dead, I tell you, he dead. I think that actually gives you. No. Um. That's so ludicrous if you kill them with a recommended ability. Um. You know. Um. I think it's two or three JP. I'm probably actually gonna stop this first video after this mission's done. Um, not sure how long I want these videos to be. I might do it more, um, landmarky than a specific amount of time. So we're going to go ahead and end this, and we will take it from there. Uh, let, let's get this story stuff out of the way. Really?
Jacob was like, that was, that was a that was a crappy mission to pick on, dude. Let's put the pass right here between these two cities. And we'll stop the recording for now. Um, I don't know how long I want to make each one of these, but this has been fun, and I'm really enjoying this, and I hope you guys are. If you're watching, thank you. Um, like, comment down in below about how big of a doofus I am. Whatever you want to do. Uh, subscribe. That'd be nice. But you don't have to. Alright, everybody. I'll be back later.